Welcome, welcome! It's my dog with the Texas Space Navy bringing you another Star Citizen video. Had a little bit of an interesting incident that happened today while messing around. Thought I'd get a little bit of that in this video. But I also wanted to talk to you guys about some future possible upcoming content. So, for starters, did you like the Q&A session? Do you want to see me open it up wider to all of my YouTube viewers uh, to do a Q&A for all of you guys rather than just for my Discord users. Um, let me know in the comments down below if that's something you might be interested in participating in. And we will see what we can do on that front. So the next thing I also want to talk about is would you guys like to see some sort of I guess light RP or role play uh, that you know I could just come up with as I'm running across the Stanton system. And, you know, maybe I make up my own story as I'm doing it. Uh, you know, I can make up my own characters, whatever. Do you guys want to see some sort of role play like that? Uh, do you want to see it solo? Do you want to see it with multi crew? Do you want to see it at all? Uh, let me know that in the comments as well. Uh, I think that would be kind of neat. I got the idea really while I was filming the latter half of this video. Uh, some of the footage I got going towards Levski. And uh, it, it gave me a good idea on well, what I could do to, to possibly role play some moments. Uh, we don't see a whole lot of role play in Star Citizen as of yet. And we know that that's going to be something that a lot of people are going to be into. And they're going to have a, uh, a desire to participate in. Of course, some people won't. Uh, you get that with every game. I mean, look at Grand Theft Auto. Some people are just there to blow stuff up, steal cars, drive fast, etc. And then some player people are in, really into the role play aspect of it, uh, which, you know, that game is still killing it on Twitch and, you know, YouTube uh, with people role playing on, you know, different servers and you know, it's really interesting. I know I get caught up in it every once in a while. I'm just like, I just want to see what happens next, you know. Uh, so, do you guys want to see something like that with some of my videos? Also, uh, kind of a weird question, but one that I want to throw out there. Um, you know, I talked about doing multiple games and stuff like that on this channel. Uh, and it, it got some good feedback, some bad feedback some middle-of-the-road feedback. Uh, what if I were to create a second channel and do multiple games and reviews under that channel and keep this one just for Star Citizen and Texas Space Navy? How would you guys feel about that? Would you be interested in watching that channel? Would you subscribe to that channel? Let me know in the comments as well uh, for, for that as well. Uh, I would definitely appreciate any and all feedback on that, as it's something I've definitely considered here lately. Uh, the biggest problem I will have trying to do two channels is all the video capture and editing. It will take time, and uh, you know that's not something I have a tremendous amount of at the moment. Um, so I, you know, I need to have good feedback in order for me to know if you know I should put the time and effort into creating a second channel to do some of that stuff I, I kinda think some of the reviews and some of the different games will will draw in more people that we don't necessarily have uh, in our Star Citizen channel um, I have different products that I could review here on hand I wouldn't have to go out and buy new ones and with my channel growing you know there's maybe a possibility that I could get some sponsorships and have people send some products out to me to review. Uh, let me go. Let me know what you guys think about that because that's something I really wanted to do is kind of review some different products. Some of you guys may have some questions on what I'm using, and if you have a question about what just happened in the video, let me tell you. I was too close with the Valkyrie when I loaded the rover in there. They both vanished, and I appeared here in the uh, station here to spawn another vehicle. Yeah, don't park that close to any pad if you're spawning other stuff. Just a little word of warning. But yeah, anyways, I would like to know what you guys think about the possibility of me doing some product reviews. You know, I, I use a dual joystick setup right now. 
Uh, I did have a throttle plugged in as well with pedals. I never used the pedals. Uh, I just, I, my feet fidget too much. So, you know, my, my usage of the pedals would be uh, incidental at best. And the throttle I used a little bit, but I just, I prefer dual joysticks. Most things, if we're talking about racing or bigger ships, I did enjoy using the throttle. Um, I just needed the extra USB for a couple of things, so I did unplug it. That's something I need to make sure a future PC build has is plenty of USB uh, 3.0 slots, or at least USB slots that I can have so many different peripherals plugged into. That is something uh, I'll have to deal with when the time comes. I'm nowhere near that time to uh, get a new PC build uh, for my gaming and YouTube hobbies. Somewhere in the future, maybe. Uh, as you can see here, I am taking the Tumbrel Cyclone out on Daymar at night, which is always a fun experience. All these little rocks you can usually drive through. Some of the big ones you cannot. Um, I will end up hitting one that you couldn't drive over, and you'll see what happens there. While we're waiting for that moment, I could get into some of the leaks that I've heard. Actually, this is one hell of a jump, by the way. Uh, but yeah, I've heard about some possible more leaks coming for 310. Don't expect it coming this week or this weekend at all. Um, they're just not expecting to be able to be released uh, Wave 1 or otherwise um, this weekend. So, kind of bad news. But at this point, I guess we all expect it from CIG. Uh, as you can see, I kind of flipped over here and I won't be able to recover that. So, no 310. We do have some other news as well leaking. Um, at first, we heard there might be some wipes, some like account wipes and stuff to where, you know, we wouldn't be able to uh, have our stuff that we've bought or earned in the universe. They would wipe it all clean like a fresh slate to what you bought in real life. But... They may have just changed that to just meaning you'll be able to wipe your helmet. <laughs> so like if you're at Microtech and it fogs up or snow gets on it, they will give us an option to wipe our helmets off to try to clear that up a little bit. Interested to see how that mechanic will work exactly. I mean, I know that it's pretty annoying for me anyways when I have a wet visor and I'm trying to drive around or fly around. Um, as you can see, when I got out of the Tumble Cyclone, I fell through the planet. I decided I'd see how long it would let me fall. I'm not going to make you guys sit through that. Let's just say that timer down there went till the end. Uh, it was up over 250 degrees Celsius before I started burning to death as well. It was not a glorious death, and I never saw anything but what you see now for the most part. Uh, I was probably 30 or 40 kilometers away from the cyclone when I finally perished. So there are still some clipping through planet issues. Looking back at yesterday's Q&A, uh, there's a couple of those questions that could be turned into videos uh, and I could do a longer drawn out explanation for some of the answers and I plan on doing some of that. Uh, so keep your eyes peeled for that and ears peeled for that. And I will also be doing some more of the lore stuff. I want to get some of that out before the end of the month. Um, maybe some real Texas lore. Uh, you know, kind of try to build upon that as well. I want to build it all the way into the org and the org lore. Uh, so you guys can hear and see a little more about where everything's coming from. Uh, so let me know what your thoughts are on that in the comments down below. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed before. Uh, I know this is probably information light and more me questions to you. So I do appreciate any comments you guys give back uh, regarding what I was asking earlier. I, I definitely appreciate you guys watching these videos. Uh, I wanna bring you some better content and I know today's content's a little 
little shy on that. Just some weird little quirks that have happened here and there. Uh, but, you know, you got to see the quirks to know that, hey, that's out there. Because when it happens to you, it's not, not much fun when you, you get it. Uh, but at least you'll know what's going on whenever it does happen to you. Because you've seen it here. So, yeah. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. If you're interested in joining the org, that information is down below in the description as well. Uh, check my Patreon out, my YouTube memberships out. I definitely would appreciate it. I'm Mud Dog with the Texas Space Navy, and I'll see you out in the verse.